Hey Pisces, we're going to see what is going on and keep in mind the energy is going to be vice versa, friend and co-worker. Pisces. Pisces. So Pisces, I feel like you've been through a lot. You're kind of distancing yourself. Um, you're cutting off anyone who's trying to breadcrumb you, string you along. I just feel like right now, I think you have some deep emotions that I feel like you're just kind of keeping to yourself. Um, I feel like you're, there's just a sense of really not being satisfied with the way things are, you know? For some of you, I just feel like you wanna clear your head. It's like, you want the clarity, you want truth. You possibly know what the truth is, you know? Um, the communication, maybe you want more clear communication. You want a change in life. I feel like you want something new, something different. Um, Pisces. So Pisces, I feel like whoever you have been dealing with or are dealing with, I feel like this person has walked away. Um, or you have, you know, feel free to switch the roles, but I feel like this person, they're trying to just heal themselves. Maybe they're, you know, they're not talking at the moment. They could have been leaving you hanging. Um, Pisces. Maybe you were waiting for this person to communicate with you, and maybe they just haven't. Maybe both of you have been confused in the situation. Um, maybe they felt confused. Um, Pisces. Pisces, I asked, how does this person feel about you? So, either they're feeling shut out from your life. For some of you, they just feel like you don't care about them, care about their feelings. But now for some of you, you know, you could feel like they don't care. They just shut the door in your face. But I asked, how did they feel about you? They, I think they felt left out from you. And that's why they walked away. Because they're not coming towards you anymore. Whoever this is. Um, hmm. See, how do they feel about you? The Five of Cups and the Four of Swords. So this person... They've slowly are releasing, trying to release their emotions for you. Um, I felt like they didn't know what to do. They were at a crossroads. What do I do? Now, Pisces, they do feel like you're the emperor or empress, whichever. Um, like you are the one for them but they feel like you weren't very consistent. Um, maybe you just, you know, came came and, and left as you pleased. You didn't really put a lot of effort into it. You know what I mean? Um, Pisces. Oops. So, how you feel about this person, maybe you feel like they're the one too. Um, they could have been at a distance. Maybe you were waiting for them. Maybe you're still waiting for them. Maybe you guys had plans. So something happened. So this is kind of tying in with the last reading of yours. It's like something happened in the past. Maybe they had made a decision. You made a decision. And so you were waiting for this to happen. Waiting. So maybe you're waiting for something to happen. You're waiting 
for this person to take action, communication. Um, mm. So you have a lot of three of swords. You have a lot of, um, you have a lot of emotional pain going on. You know, Pisces, how you feel about this person, maybe you were just not really interested in them. So that's what I'm saying. Maybe, or maybe they feel like you're, you weren't interested in them. There, there could have just been like some miscommunication for some. Um, maybe you just wanted to have fun. You didn't want anything serious, but they, they got really emotionally invested in you. Maybe more than you realized. Um, oh, I feel like this person has suffered a great deal of emotional pain for you. Um, you probably don't even realize how deep this is for this person. Um, Pisces. Pisces. So, I feel like this is over, but the world is also, you, you could come back for another cycle. It's about cycles. So you could, you know, this could go another round. It would just depend on, on whoever, but I just feel like it was, it was a lot of burdens. It was a lot of, um, Someone was stuck and trapped in your love. Like, I'm serious. Someone was uh, imprisoned by your love. And I don't, I don't even know that you realize this. I don't know. For some of you. Hmm. Wow. Um, Pisces. almost wanted to flip out, but you have the nine of swords there. I mean, I'm sorry, the seven of swords. Um, so you have the, um, the hangman and the page of wands. So for some of you, this person stayed very secluded or they could be because you have the hermit they could be very secluded right now they're they just want to be left alone for some or this could be you you spend a lot of time alone um i think you and this person you're both very deep but but the obstacle is seven of swords um So maybe there was just a lot of miscommunication. There could have been a lot of dodging, dodging the truth, dodging something. You know what I mean? Um, Pisces. So what is an outcome for Pisces outcome? So the outcome is the three of wands. So for some of you, they're still waiting. The four of swords is at the bottom. Or for some of you, this person, you or this person, have, have just turned their back on this whole situation. You know? Pisces. The Hermit. So that's the outcome. I just feel like there's, there's no communication. It's like ghosting and it's just like... It's like a silent ending. Um, whew. You have the moon. So you could also be feeling this way. I just see this card sometimes as deep hidden emotions. It's like someone's drowning. 
and their emotions. Every time I do your reading now, I just want to cry. I know Pisces are very deep, um, but this is like someone suffering in silence, I feel. It's just a deep, deep emotional, um, just drowning. It's like someone's just uh, overwhelmed with emotions. Okay. Uh. I will tell you, I absolutely love, 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 love a Pisces. They are like one of my favorite signs. Um, mm. Okay. Pisces. All right, Pisces, how do you feel about this person? How does Pisces feel about this person? Wow. You have true love. How does Pisces feel about this person? So you have, um, give your relationship a chance. Work on your partnership. But there's, you know what I'm feeling? For some of you, there, there could be other people that depend on you and now, and vice versa. I don't want to keep saying that, but you know what I mean. Or they, they have people that depend on them, whatever. There's some type of codependency on others that is causing this relationship not to come together, I feel like. I don't feel like there's... Uh, I don't feel like there's going to be um, a reconciliation because of, of others others that need you or others that need them. But um, it's like this, okay, <laughs> I don't know whose emotions I'm picking up on, but this is like a very deep love. How does this person feel about Pisces? Okay. How does this person feel about Pisces? How does this person feel about Pisces? So see this person there, they're pulling back. Um, everything's just been called off. It's like there's no engagement. There, it's like there's there's no chance for this relationship to happen, and they know it. Um, or maybe they felt like you didn't give them a chance. You know, it, it could go either way. See, I feel like someone. This person may feel like you're with someone. Um, there could be children involved and there's just something that's holding someone back from taking a chance with whoever this is. Maybe they felt like it was going good at the beginning. There was a lot of chemistry and then all of a sudden there was a separation. It's almost like even before you got to really know each other, um, I don't know if someone got married in an unrequited love situation. So someone could already be married and they're not in love with whoever they're married to. You know what I mean? It's, it's, um, it seems complicated, but there's a lot of silence going on right now. Um, so anyway, I'm sorry. I'm such a crybaby in your readings here lately, but that is what I have for you. See you in the next one.